after you do your cultura diaria, go to Would You Rather. Would you rather live in a giant gingerbread house or ride the Polar Express? And I love them both. Of course you do. What's not to love? After you do that, we're going to go to our assignments today. And our assignments today is Christmas winter vocab. The instructions are here. You are going to learn Christmas winter vocabulary words. You are to use the Google Slides document, this one. You are to look up the words in Spanish using this site. Do not log in and do not sign up. Do not worry about logging in. Do not worry about signing up. Erase the English word, put the Spanish word, then paste an image that matches the picture at the bottom. If you're uncomfortable doing either the winter or the Christmas words, please let me know. Christmas words. So you are here and insert your first and last name there. And then it says Christmas tree or snowman. So one is a secular word, one's non-secular, which means one is about Christmas, one is not about Christmas. Choose whichever one that you are more comfortable with and then look up those words using this website here. Okay, after you use that website, then you look up one of the above words in Spanish. So you go here to images, you uh, search the web, and then you would type, for example, Christmas tree. Christmas tree. And then you would choose one, you would drop and drag it over, and you would resize to put here. But you would obviously erase all that. You would erase all that. Then you put your pictures there. You can do one or two. You do not have to do both. You just do one or the other, depending on which you are comfortable with. Oh, and Monday. Yes. Monday. Hang on. Monday. Zoom free, a Zoom peer, free period for you from my class. So I want you to be working on this. Um, you're not going to be on Zoom. You're going to just do, be doing this and try to finish it and submit it. Hasta luego. Tengo un buen fin de semana.